Hey you guys, it's still Minecraft here today, and today we're going to be playing a little bit of Mopio. So that's a bit of a so this is a bit of a series that I haven't continued for a while, and there's been quite a lot of updates, so I guess I guess why not do it? <laughs> All right, so yeah, some are doing kind of well. Some are doing kind of well already. Not really, <clears throat> not really immediately getting chased, and I take that back. I take that back. Okay, mo most of this video is going to be it's a lot of time lapse and fail. Okay, so I, I, I've got to like chase after all these though. <laughs> yes, okay, there you go. Just got to hunt all the small fish. Okay. Let's see if we can just get there here. Okay. Okay, so all I have to do here. Oh, okay, mouse. Why is there a mouse in there? Like seriously, that's like the worst strategy ever. Okay, hold on. Okay, seven notes. I've gone out of turn. Whoa, what the Okay, okay, why is there a rabbit there? That's like that's that's very weird. I mean, it's like, like you'd expect them to at least be a trout, you know, rabbit. Tra rabbit would be equivalent to trout in this game. Okay. And I now have to get through this and get through this some more. Okay. Speed up. Eat trout. Eat other bigger trout. Ooh, crab. And get absolutely owned by stingrays, but then after, uh, but after that, absolutely owned these stingrays. Now go after Mopio and the, and La Flame, which is ironic because they're in water. So, don't know. Like somehow La Flame survived in water with a, uh, with, with a squid chasing it. I kind of don't see any logic in that, but okay. Actually, to be honest, I, I don't see very much logic in anything. Okay, so this is actually a cool method here. It's incredibly, incredibly effective. But the idea is just go back and forth the whole t time between the with rivers. And it especially helps once you get to puffer fish. If you get to puffer fish. It's probably well with this strategy, but it's amazingly good once you get there because then you can eat the purple shells like over there that the rhino just ate. And then once you can eat the purple shells, those things give you a lot of XP and there's a lot of them. So that's like, so that means that you can get a lot of, uh, the, uh, a lot of food li just like that. So then go up to the north one. And I know that is an octopus in disguise there. That bit of seaweed there, because I saw it move. <laughs> and besides, if it isn't, then well, I'm pretty sure it is. But if it isn't, then well, keep in mind it's just a little bit of seaweed that isn't very handy once I get to this level. I just ate the mole and the fox. I kind of find it weird that a mole can swim like that. But okay, and get away from the kraken there. And I'm an octopus. Bit of a progress update there. Okay, hold on. I actually want to see. Thing is with octopus's ability, it's only good when you're actually running. Because you let them bump into you with your disguise ability. Okay. You let them bump into you with that, and that actually stuns them, right? Okay. And another kraken. See, that's that's why the ability is so bad. You can't go underwater with it. So it's one final run I'm just gonna go for. It's gonna go for this. Yeah, I know. It's a really short let. Uh, it's a really short let's play. I mean, like earlier in the channel, I would have done like twenty minute let's plays, but uh, but uh, but but you know, just you know, higher amount, higher percentage. So okay. Generally, more statistics equals good. Okay. Then, if the uh, then percentage of watch time is a statistic. Okay. If you. Uh, if you watched five minutes out of a twenty-minute video, okay, then it, you'd have then that would be 
a 25% watch time or one fourth watch time. Okay, if you watched five minutes out of a 10 minute video, that'd be fifth. That'd be 50%. And if you did a uh, five out of five, then that would be 100%. So I guess. So I guess the point there. So the point there, I guess. Is to. Sorry, I'll just do it like that. I'm gonna see if I can get to Croc. I'm pretty close to Croc. It's got a few thousand to go. There we go. Only problem with Croc is that it's very, very vulnerable to like uh, to uh, to basically anything, and it can't. You know, Croc to me, Croc should be able to go in hills because besides Rhino, literally everything like uh, n like it can go into a hill. So you have no place to hide, somehow. So that should be a good thing. So hey guys, please leave a like, please subscribe, please watch my other videos, only comment below, leave a lot, click the zoom, tell it, I said Minecraft out. Bye!